And I'll also mention too that a fellow that, I, that uh, has been in touch with me for an awful long time, his brother was in the CIA, or is in the CIA. He will never talk about the CIA to him. He, I mean, he'll never give anything away whatsoever, except one bit of advice. He said, never watch the television. Never watch the television. It's the greatest scientific indoctrination tool ever devised. Haven't you figured that out? It's changed the whole culture of nations, not just one nation. Why do you think it was mandatory that everybody in Britain give access to televisions by the government? Why do you think China is under the the same program to get everyone to the TV right now? Because they love to have you entertained. Do you really think that? And India is on the same route as well right now too. Most of your ideas and your opinions and how you emulate, because you emulate things, you mimic what you see, as Charles Galton, Darwin and others have said in the past. It becomes you, you become it. And that's what's happened. It's been very, very, very successful. Never watch the television. You can't watch a movie unless you do it critically, if you watch it critically. Not there to enjoy it. Remember what they say, it's your emotions that get you on. And it's interwoven, all these emotional themes all through movies. You're played like a harp. And they embed ideas in you, into you, along with the movies. And predictive programming too. So you'll accept that which is still to come. And you'll, and you'll behave the same way as the characters in the movie when it comes. Oh well, what can you do? I'll just watch much music or television. Yeah. You're given a mind of your own. And you've got to use it for yourself. And believe you me, if you ever had a nation or wanted a nation, you'd have to make sure that everyone took their turn. Everyone took their turn. Just like jury duty, to go in and oversee the guys that are supposed to be taking care of everything on your behalf. It's a tight club right now. It's been like that forever. Because they never intended to give you anything called democracy. Or, in fact, a republic. Gangs and fraternities run the systems of the countries. That's how they run. And under taxation, taxation, and it's true what Marx said, and it's true what Lenin said, that with that part of it, all, all wealth comes from labor. And tax is another term for labor. When they take your labor from you and give you nothing back for it, that's called stealing and slavery. Slavery, folks. But no teacher told you that, did they? Look at the dictionaries. You can find an old enough one because they keep changing them too. From Hamish myself from Ontario, Canada, it's good night to mean your God or your gods go with you.